What's up? This is Joey Arya from ECX, shopecx.com, and today we're going to review the District V3, the third version of the District Deck. Um, I think the technical term is something like District DK12 or something like that, but I call it the V3, and um, here it is right here. I've got the um, pink, purplish color, I guess you could say. <laughs> And uh, pretty gnarly. I've been riding mine for a while, and that's what I have left of it. But, um, anyways, I've got another review online um, on the District uh, Version 2, the District V2. And uh, basically, this, the V3, I have all the same thoughts on it as the, the V2. Well, the difference between this deck is it is a little bit longer, it's a little bit stronger. Um, you can see how they reconstructed the front here, how um, it's longer right here. The the head tube, they reconstructed this, it's, uh, it's a bit stronger. So it's going to hold up a little bit better. But like I said, it's just a little bit longer, um, gives you a little more space. Um, head tube angle is, more, uh, is better, it's 82.5, so you get better nose manuals and uh, just more room. Um, you're not going to hit your knees on your bars as much and uh, just more feet room, better feel when you're riding around doing airs, grinding and whatnot. So the head tube angle is more steep. Um, so you're going to notice that difference. When you first get it, it's really hard to tail whip. Um, it comes around real slow. It's hard to bring it back. It feels all weird, but I got used to it in um, maybe a good week or so and now it's fine. So anyways, that's, um, that's the district V3. Um, the last thing I forgot to mention is that it is integrated, so uh, it's got a nice integrated headset that you can get for it right there. So that's another thing I like. Nice and solid. Spins nice, and uh, that's pretty much it. Comes in cool, a lot of cool colors. Um, this one's pretty gnarly, stands out. Um, so, anyways, that's all my thoughts on the District V3. You can get it at Shop ECX, uh, shopecx.com.